Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome back to the channel. It's your boy Worst Seven Gamer, and today I got a brand new fresh awakening for you guys. Check it out. The Ice Queen is about to be awakened today, guys. And this is so fresh. I literally had to go out there and get a fresh ass haircut for her because uh, I'm worried that this chick is gonna be too hot to handle, man. Look at her, she's gonna pop through the screen. I don't know what she's gonna look like awakened, but I can't wait. And today's the day to do it, so let's not waste any time. Let's go ahead, right ahead, guys. I'm going to go into her awakening because uh, I've already done the majority of it right now. Part number two, check it out. Four out of six is done. The last two uh, uh, sweeps right now. Let's go. Woohoo! I'm really rushing to get this done. I just wanna see the transformation, man. The transformation. In the whole G Nation, let's go ahead to part number three here. Um, all right, so Alicia must be the one to kill Seraphim. No, damn, she has to kill my girl Seraphim. Wow, it's like two hot girls fighting over you, man. Wowzers, Bowsers. In this situation, she has to be the one that wins, but Seraphim is fine as hell, too, guys. So, jeez, I don't even know. Let me know in the comments who the hell you guys would pick, man. If you had a choice. Would you pick Seraphin? When what am I doing? Or would you pick um, Alicia here? But I almost just screwed this whole thing up, guys. So for this situation, you're going to have to put heroes. In my situation, actually, every situation is different. So you got to take it as your situation comes. But in my case, I'm level 100. All my heroes are maxed out. I have to be careful of what heroes I use. Or else somebody else will be able to kill her and then I lose. I'll have to retry. So I'm going to just go ahead and uh, use the heroes that will not do much damage. So, you know what, Enrique. Who else can I use? Um, oh, Lucius. Wait a minute, I don't have a tank. So we're going to go down and put our old trusty old pal. Hey, trusty old pal. Where is he? I'm looking for Leon. Leon... Uh, what the? Oh, there he is. I was going to say, Leon, where the hell is he hiding? Leon, for somebody to pee on. But anyways, let's go ahead, guys. Part number one is very easy. It looks like just three heroes you got to kill here. So let's go, Alicia. Do it to her. I'm pretty convinced that Alicia will probably get the win here, guys. Her ultimate is insane. It does so much damage to so many heroes. And especially in my case here, uh, she's in five stars maxed out so let's see how long it takes her to kill her i'm not worried if she will kill her let's use the ultimate here and see what it does watch this boom boom destroyed everybody except the hero that's immune to magic god damn it they always gotta screw me over with this shit all right so this is immune to magic here which means we can only hit them with our basic attacks because most of my heroes are stinking magic and they don't do any damage at all oh my god all right, well, luckily, they're weak. <laughs> so even a little basic attacks are doing enough damage to get me the win here. But damn, this kind of blows. All right, fast forward this a little bit. Never mind, I don't have to. All right, here we go. Part three, guys. All right, I'm not sure if I need to go with uh, Alicia right away or do some other tangy me jiggies. But first of all, let me s put them to sleep. I'm going to boost up my physical and magic attack here. And then we're going to go. Go now. This should do it right here. Boom, boom. Ha <laughs> ha. Woohoo. That was one hit KO on everybody. All right. That was pretty easier. Easier than I actually thought. So let's go. Back out of here, guys. All right. Who's ready for this? If you're ready for this, guys, make sure you drop a like for new awakenings and make sure you have the lotion and the napkins ready to go because this might be really good to handle. You might not even uh, be able to handle this, guys. So let's go ahead. Booyah, guys. Let's go. What the hell is this? Oh, man. She literally just turned into Elsa from Frozen. Wow. Actually, that's exactly who she is. That looks pretty sick. So I like it in that aspect. This looks just like Elsa from Frozen. It's pretty sick, but I hate it. She's like fully clothed. Man. Let's see the artwork. Oh, man. She looks like some type of Disney character. Actually, it does look pretty sick though. Wow. She's got her staff. She's holding that rod really nice. Wow, look at her holding that rod. 
Ice Queen. All right, guys. So I'm pretty excited to have her anyways. So let's go ahead and break down the Awakening quest and see what this is actually going to do for our team. And if it actually makes her a lot better. And I'm saying actually way too many actually times. I don't even know why I'm doing that. But let's keep going. Queen's Protection. All right. When Alicia's health is critically low, she casts a spell which forms a shield around the teammate. This shield can absorb some damage. Okay. So let me go ahead and put 20 points on it right now. All right. It absorbs up to 9,000 damage. Hey, that's pretty sick. And it's got an ice attribute. Okay, okay. That's not bad at all. Hmm, I can dig that. Let me see if there's anything I can give her, guys. You know what? I'm just going to give her physical toughness there, max health. And another max health. Why not? Just some added bonuses. All right, let's go ahead and move on to the next part. All right, so here we are in the 4G McGeorgie. Let's just go ahead and auto-forge her 50 times here. Just for a small amount of bonuses. And then, after this, the thing is, I've already done her academy, as you guys probably were there live or something. So, everything else is done. After this, I'm going to take her in an arena battle and see if she's actually viable in the arena right now with all the physical heroes in there. But this awakening does make it seem like she should be, alright? Because uh, when she's about to die, she's actually going to help somebody else out, which could turn the tide of the battle. So, let's see, guys. Let's jump into the uh, battle. All right, so this is as tough of a challenge as you can pretty much see, guys. Batman, Rayman, Volko, Mira, and Valon. This is a typical team in my server. So let's see what's going to happen here with her awakening. Is it going to work? I'm not sure exactly how low her HP has to be because uh, it's already below hell, half health here. If she can get an ultimate off, that would be sick. Get an ultimate! Yes! Yes! All right, pretty sweet, pretty sweet. She's got her ultimate off. And uh, it's kind of hard to tell where her awakening actually, I mean, yeah, where her awakening actually went. I can't see it. But um, it might have taken an effect. Maybe I just didn't notice. Hmm. I might have to just replay that and take a look over again, guys. It's slow mo. Uh, I didn't see anybody get a bonus shield for a second, but. Uh, battle's still going on. There is a chance to still win this. Even though it's looking slimmer and slimmer by the second. Ah, oh God. Three on one. Batman's chances are very low here. Here he goes. He killed Batman. Wow. All right. So my Batman killed his Batman. It's two on one now. Time is running out. Oh, shit. And he might not have enough time here. He's confused. Another ultimate could finish off Valon. But Mira is still alive. Okay. Another ultimate with seven seconds left. Is it possible? Oh, there's like a second left! I won! What the hell was that? Wow! That was one of the most epic wins ever. Holy shit. How the world... That was his fourth ability, guys. The one that he uh, calls in his Batmobile or whatever. The, 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 the flying machine and uh, kills the hero when it's on its last dying breath. So, really sweet, Batman. You are a true G. But, take a look at who did the second most damage on my team, guys. Alicia. She does incredible amounts of damage. When it's AoE damage, it's crazy good. Problem is, she dies like a magic hero. Always dies too early. So, that's never good. But, you can always expect high damage when it comes to, uh, to Alicia. That's for sure. Alright, guys. So, wrapping up this Awakening now. Um, I'm still impressed with Alicia. I liked her before the Awakening. And now, I like her even more. I gotta go ahead... Test this out a little bit more here. When Alicia health is critically low, she casts a sh uh, spell which forms a shield around the teammate. This shield can absorb some damage. All right, I got to go ahead and take a look at this again. I didn't see it during the battle, but there was a lot going on at once. And this is actually my first battle with her awakened, so uh, it was hard to see. But do more testing. I think she definitely could. De you could definitely use her in the arena because I used her there. That was for the second spot of all-time arena, you know. So, uh... Obviously, she's definitely usable, and I do love her. I think she's actually one of my favorite uh, magic heroes in the game right now. So, that's, you know, something. And at 5 stars, all enchanted, everything, guys. This is the stats that I'm working with right now with her, so check them out. Let's see here. Magic attack, 4,800, plus another 1,000. That's actually pretty good magic attack, guys. That's really good. She's got a nice magic crit rating and magic pierce rating, so... Uh, those are all good stats. HP 36,000. That's not a lot, but 
You know what I'm saying? The defense is never usually Magic Hero's strong suit, but the attack is where it's at right now. AoE attack. And uh, another component to our all famous freeze team, guys. I'm always, always trying to enhance that. I don't show you enough, but I'm still working on that in the background. But all right, guys, for now, I'm going to end it off here. I hope you guys enjoy Alicia. I think she's pretty dope. Another great character to add to the squad. And uh, we'll, you know, I'm looking forward to playing with her a lot more as the time comes on. All right, guys. So for now, I'm going to end it off here. I will catch you guys next time on another Soul Hunters video. Till then, have a good morning, good afternoon, and good night. Peace out, everybody.